How y'all doing today? Another epic adventure at Weaver Stonehouse Farms with Aaron Weaver, the boiler guy. Today, we're fixing a Buck 91 stove and we're working with a Midwest Hearth fan speed control. And there were a bunch of videos and there were two daggone long. So we're just gonna get to the point and get to work to show you. So you take the parts, make sure your power's turned off. And by the way, this is not an instructional video. This is just how I get it done. Make sure the power's turned off so we unplug it. It's unplugged, great. Fan speed control, two wires, switch, and the nut. First, we pop that off. Spin the nut loose. Drop the control out. Now this control we had replaced before when I first got the stove because it was broken. We had a blower motor failure and it kind of melted it. So the original wires, all I did was just cut them and I already had them previously wire nutted. And then this one, I just used the old wire off the old switch. I cut it off, stripped it. And that's it for that control. Real simple, black to black. to white control up in New nut, old nut, really doesn't matter. This is the part people get confused with. Don't be. Gotta grip it, push, turn. There's no threads. You're cutting the threads in. So you gotta hold it on the back. It's good, it's in sight, doesn't take a whole lot. Line your knob up. I don't worry about lining up on the sticker because when you adjust it, you can't see the sticker anyways because it's down here. So we'll plug it back in, turn it on, put it to manual, turn the power switch on. And that's it. So that's simple. Aaron Weaver, Weaver Stonehouse Farms, your boiler guy.